The Weather Center talking about a nice day. Won't get too hot today. No, not too shabby at all. And we've got another cool down on the horizon with more shower chances ahead. And then on the back side of that, some more concerns heading your way. And what I'm talking about here, your impact tracker as we head through this week, dry and warm to start the week for the afternoon. At least this morning it's brisk. We'll have cooler temperatures and showers likely Wednesday. Some mountain showers potentially lingering into Thursday. But in the wake of this wet system that's going to roll through, we're going to have gusty north winds returning and very dry conditions driving elevated fire danger from Thursday into your weekend. Now a live look outside this morning at the Sundial Bridge in Redding where it's looking pretty de decent right now, but we are going to see some haze as an impact early to midday, especially in our northern zones of the valley. So something to keep in mind there. And as we move forward, as I would mentioned, we do have elevated fire danger on the horizon. Now starting at 11 a.m. Thursday, lasting through 8 p.m. Saturday, the stronger north winds developing and the dry conditions. So humidity down to as low as 10 percent. Gusts up to around 40 miles an hour expected. And the worst of this is really expected on Friday. And so that is something that we do need to plan around. Now, early this week, low temperatures, 50s to low 60s in the valley in foothills, 30s to 40s in most of our mountain zones. But Alturas dipping into the 20s this morning, 29 degrees there. Wind out of the northeast to 7 miles an hour right now for Red Bluff. But we'll see southeast winds this afternoon that stay pretty modest, 5 to maybe 10 miles an hour out of the southeast. Stronger south winds tomorrow as the cooler system starts to roll towards the coast. Could see 10 to 15 mile an hour gusts out of the southeast. Stronger winds overnight tomorrow into early Wednesday morning, and then we're already seeing those winds shifting to become out of the north late Wednesday into Thursday. And again, those north winds will dry things out a bit as the shower chances fizzle out as well. Satellite and radar clear skies overnight into this morning, and that's thanks in no small part to high pressure to our north, east, and west surrounding us right now. But we also have these cooler systems that are rolling towards the west coast, and they're mostly going to be tracking inland in the Pacific Northwest starting late Tuesday into Wednesday, and that will bring that next round of shower chances with them. So today, sunny skies to start the day. We'll have mostly sunny skies at noon and then some thin clouds brushing overhead by 5 p.m., but no showers expected. Clear skies tonight, mostly sunny throughout your Tuesday. And then again, Wednesday is when we see that chance for showers ramping back up across our region, lasting through most of the day. And then we'll see the chance for mountain showers lingering Thursday, but then we'll dry out and warm back up from Friday into your upcoming weekend and then cool back down a little bit on Sunday with more shower chances early next week. So checking in with how much we're expecting to see for rainfall totals looks like maybe about a tenth of an inch to a quarter of an inch for most of the valley, half an inch for the foothills, could see up to a half an inch in some of our Sierra locations as well. So decent rainfall, but not enough to put an end to fire season this week. Meanwhile, temperatures 70s to low 80s in the northern mountains, 70s for the most part in the Sierra and Southern Cascades, foothills in the 70s as well. And if you're in the valley today, mid to upper 80s for the northern zones, 88 degrees for Redding and Red Bluff, 85 degrees for Chico, 83 degrees for Orville, 87 degrees for Willow. So a bit of a mixed bag, but mostly just ending up in the 80s this afternoon. Your Storm Tracker 7 day forecast where your weekend's always in view. Similar to slightly cooler temperatures and mostly sunny skies Tuesday, low to mid 70s with Showers Wednesday, still in those lower to mid 70s Thursday. Cloudy, but looking for the most part dry in the valley with mountain showers. And then breezy to gusty north winds and dry conditions driving elevated fire danger. Friday into Saturday as we warm up with another cooling trend arriving Sunday and lasting into the early portion of next week. Fall is coming in. All right, thanks, Court.